Hey, it's me, Zell, and we are here with another reaction. I was going to say another episode. I guess that's right. Another episode of Star Wars Visions. Season 2 and Episode 2 today. Uh, Screechers Reach. So, cool name already. Um, but yeah, so far I enjoyed the previous episode. Off to a good start. Again, love to see the different artistic style, but also storytelling style with the basic world or lore of of star wars universe so whether it's um force related with the jedi or sith or in betweens or just utilizing some of the different species we find in the world planets equipment etc so fun to see um people's different takes on it so we're going to continue that with episode two screechers reach let's get to it Alarm clock popping off. Looks like, yeah, 2D animation style. We're doing some coal dumping. We got an overheating valve. Oh, no! Run, run, run. Oh, he's fed up. He's over it. You actually have a choice? Oh. I'm getting out of here, Bathan. We're getting out of here? Oh, yes! Irish. Where are we going? I'm going to Screech's Reach. No way! That place is haunted. That's three uh, days walk. What's going on? Oh. You want to see a ghost? So they can just dip out of work. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! His skinny legs. That's so pretty. Sound of that screaming. No, they're just stories, right, Dal? I heard the ghost isn't a thing you can touch. You see it in your mind. Well, in my mind, I'm kicking her up the arse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kick her up the arse. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get <laughs> Better, right? There are worse lives, Dal. There are better lives. Oh. Anyway. Half, glass half full, body. glass half empty. <laughs> Why? Look at him. You too. Go easy. Come on. We're not far now. Oh, what a good friend. Oh, the they're so cute. <laughs> yeah. Just because it's dark is enough for me. More terrifying things come out of Kina's nose. Shut up, you. Cool. An electric lantern. Oh, come on. Oh no, of course the don't fail. I don't want to see a ghost. <gasps> I saw the ghost. Nah. <laughs> well, you guys are stuck there now. That's terrifying. Oh, I got you. No, Aww. Kina. Go with them. Down. Come on, down. Why is she coming? I'll be right behind you. Go. Go. She needs to know more, I guess. That is a very lost soul. Take it. It's yours now. Oh. It's almost like a night sister. She 
tears and scream pain and fear. Wow, she is. Maybe she ended their misery. She was real. A real person. Dale, what did you do? I was strong. Uh oh. You gave me strength. And now it's time for us to meet. Oh, Dale, snap. What is that? Is that an Inquisitor shaped ship? Whoa. Dude, that's a cool. I love all these unique ship designs. It looks a bit like Ahsoka from afar. The true test is always in your mind. And you did what you had to do, right? So, did I pass? You passed. Come, child. <gasps> Are my friends too? No. This was always for you, my young apprentice. Only you. Dal, who is this? <laughs> she promised me another life. Make her choice. Oof, she... she evil looking. Her apartment's like, not like this. An interesting take. Light and dark, both. Oof. That gave me shift. That gave me tingles. Wow. That one was really short and sweet. Very emotional. Like, <laughs> it's like bittersweet but bittersweet's not the right word because it's like the deep sadness that all the kids and even her had but also the fear anger almost disappointment or betrayal i don't know that the emotions the kids were wearing were like that and she was like almost like desperation like i need to do whatever i can to get out of here i want a new path i want a different path a better path and even though she seemed like a good person you could tell like you know in the sith we've seen people take like anakin honestly like I, it reminds me that moment when anakin uh, through desperation took up under Sidious after, you know, it almost didn't seem like a choice because she knew it's what was going to happen. So that's what it reminded me of. The emotion that child doll was feeling reminded me of Anakin when he decided to go under an apprentice under. She was so desperate to do another path that even though she felt there was some questionable of it, I mean, she just killed somebody. She killed that person who was clearly hiding away, but suffering, like deep suffering. She was keeping to herself though. So like, this is an older person that's been like so broken down, you know, by these powers over time. Anyways, it was just a, again, it's so interesting how short these stories can be, but then how much you can Whole extrapolate from it so really interesting concept um good art style good storytelling and emotions were real so yeah good job uh and yeah thanks for watching guys if you want to show support for the channel don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't otherwise i'll see you on the next one